one of the most important aspects of using a trail camera is keeping it hidden. And I think that's more important. You know, we had the flash cams, which I actually liked, and we had the infrared with little red bulbs flashing the deer's eyes. I didn't like those. This is a blackout Exodus camera. It's very stealthy, very quiet, doesn't make any noise, no smell. It's even got a rubber coating on the outside. So very non-invasive camera. But then where do you set that camera? And in this case, um, I'm five foot nine on a good day. This camera you can see is well above my head, but still pretty easy to just look at the viewfinder and see what deer there, change an SD card. Another thing though too, it's above the line of sight, but at the same time, I have this small trunk right next to it, so its profile is hidden. It doesn't matter if the deer's looking this way or from the other side, they can't see this camera. So, great place to get a census for bucks. It's hidden. We have a mock scrape right there in front of me. We have a water hole. And, um, you know, there's some people that don't like using cameras and they fear that they're going to spook deer. But this is the perfect opportunity to see these bucks here. I think the rewards far outweigh the risks, and we can't wait to see what kind of pictures we get here this, uh, this hunting season.